Hey, what's up guys? Chris Altamirano here from the Via Maverick Internet Business Blog. And today I'm going to talk to you about the three Google Advanced Search Operators that I like to use when I want to find out how many pages are competing in Google for a particular keyword that you know I'm trying to target in Google and that I potentially want to rank for. So um, yeah, let's, uh, let's get started. Uh, the first thing I need you to do is just go ahead and head over to the Google Keyword Tool. And uh, I am going to be going through rather quickly, so you know, just keep up. If you need to go back, you know, just pause the video, and uh, yeah. So the first thing you want to do is uncheck broad, and then check in exact, and then just pick your keyword and type it in in the word or phrase box right here. I already have one selected that I just found for tutorial purposes, and it's best credit card for airline miles. And you have your keyword in there. Hit search, and now we'll see that best credit card for airline miles gets searched 1,600 times per month. And that's cool, you know, the competition says it's high, the, the CPC, meaning the cost per click, that's what advertisers are paying uh, potentially up to per click, $7.13. Um, but I would still like a little more data in terms of ranking. Now there are software, softwares that do that for you, but we can easily do that right here uh, using some free tools that are at our disposal. So first thing I would do is I would just click right there in the drop down and hit Google search. It's gonna open it in the new tab. And we'll see right here where it says about that two point, you know, two million ninety thousand results. That's the amount of pages that are competing for the keyword "best credit card for airline miles." And so the first Google search operator, advanced search operator that I, I like to use is the quotes. And so I'm going to put a quote in the front, and I'm going to put a quote in the back, and hit enter. So now we just dropped from about two point ninety thousand results or whatever all the way down to 98,100 pages. So now there's only there's really only 98,100 pages that are actually competing for this keyword. The rest of them that filtered out aren't even optimized. So that's a huge advantage right there. The next Google, Google Advanced Search Operator I like to use is the All in Title. You can leave the quotes around your keyword and just in the beginning put All in Title and then with the semicolon or the colon, I think that's what it is, and then just push Enter. And now we'll see that we dropped from 90 something thousand only all the way down to 7,740 results. So out of all those 90,000 something pages, only 7,740 pages within Google, indexed by Google are using best credit card for airline miles in their website title. So that's another huge advantage right there. So if you just use that in your title, you would already be beating those other 90 something thousand or at least have a little bit more of an advantage when it comes to uh, get getting ranked in Google and the last one I like to use is the all in URL the all in URL is basically telling me how many websites are using best credit card for airline miles in their permalinks and you'll see how it just pops it up right here this is the first result what is best credit card for airline miles whoever faircompare.com is and credit card form like so you'll see that if we want to go back out of 98,000 results, we filtered, if you just have your title with best credit card for airline miles, you're going to beat the rest of those. And then if, on top of that, if you have it in your URL as well, meaning, you know, your permalinks, then you are way ahead of those 2 million other people competing for best credit card for airline miles. So again, um, you know, those are the three Google advanced operators I like that I like to use, the quotes, the all in title, and the all in URL. Um, thanks for watching, guys. You know, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them um, anywhere below this video. And uh, don't forget to visit me at the Via Maverick Internet Business Blog. And if you want, go ahead and follow me on Twitter at Chris Alta. All right? Thanks a lot, guys.